as far back as I can remember, I remember visiting the flight deck when I was three and four years of age on, uh, on aircraft. Unfortunately, people can't do that anymore, but that was uh, one of the more like inspiring moments. Roco, Roco, Zero, Channel I've always had that dream. I think I've always wanted to fly. I think I've chosen wisely so far with the experience that I've had in, in the role. It's definitely moving on up. It's something that I, I've been working towards for a long time and I, I really thought that this would be the career for me. There's a big space between learning how to fly an aircraft and the instrument procedures that you operate every day and the commercial side of the operation. And when you start at Bartolini, I think you get taught the foundations, you know, of your instrument rating. Them foundations are drilled in from the start and you, you take them forward with you. We train on a Technum aircraft here in Bartolini. And I think one of the parts of the Technum aircraft is the reliability of it. It's a, it's a fluid movement from the, the Technum aircraft here at Bartolini with their Garmin setup onto the airliner and the EFIS setup that we use at the moment. Sentry 5 through Mike on 347 for uh, H right request taxi. One of the highlights for me was always just getting that license. The license was the big thing. And that should be your focus. Things will fall into place if you let them naturally progress. As long as you've got the determination, you can worry about the job afterwards. But just worry about the license. 